uh, overall is very safe and high uh, technical and uh, with high clinical success in patients undergoing different indication of uh, uh, spark displacement. Uh, but I think that one of um, that the stent uh, should be used, for example, uh, for the walled off pancreatic necrosis uh, or pseudocyst because uh, the rounded shapes uh, uh, of the flange reduce the risk of intracavity bleeding, like another stent, because other stent have some spikes in uh, in the distal part of the stent. Oxpactus have has not the spikes, but is very round shapes, and uh, it can be useful because it can diminish the risk of bleeding after stent placement. And um, uh, like I said before, if you have a small duct, if you have a small gallbladder, if you have a small jejunal loop, uh, this stent uh, should be the preferred one because you can move up and down the catheter, adjusting your movement and adjusting your position during the flange release. And the uh, point of the design of the Oxpaxus is the round shape of the flange because with other competitors we found some cases of intracavity bleeding after several days because when the uh, collection uh, collapses, okay, the stent can, can attach to the peritoneal wall or with the abdominal wall and can, can have erosing of the other vessels. Then uh, hot spots with their own shapes, in my opinion, can uh, cool avoid this. Further study must need because uh, uh, we must uh, uh, show, we must publish some data about it. I hope with the further study we publish our uh, data and we have some study uh, in ongoing we have uh, a study that we have uh, submitted showing uh, any case of bleeding with hot spaxes anyone